It's win or go home now for high school football teams. In the first round of the playoffs, is no walk in the park for any squad. Tomorrow night, the Viger Wolves kick off the first round of the playoffs with some Thursday night action. The Wolves started the season 0-3, but then something started clicking for the Viger Wolves. Week four because they haven't lost since, claiming the 5A Region 1 championship title, which means tomorrow night, Viger gets home field advantage. They hope to keep their winning streak alive as they face Jemison in the first round of the playoffs. Uh, success came with having experience and getting the guys out there on, on the field and getting that experience from what uh, what the game feels like and the, the understanding of what it takes to go win a football game. We know we got to do it like we don't. It's either win or go home, man. And our mindset, like, we don't want this uh, journey to stop. Yeah, it's a long ride. Here. Let's ride. And in 4A, the UMS Wright Bulldogs are preparing for Leeds, a team that has shattered UMS's playoff runs in both 2014 and 2015. So it's safe to say the Bulldogs want some revenge. Another fun fact about UMS, they haven't lost a first round playoff game since 2010. However, head coach Terry Curtis says he isn't taking this first game lightly. The first round scares the coach probably more than any other round, especially when you're a higher seed than what you're playing. A lot of times your players, your, your, your community, your, your school, your parents, they all kind of take it for granted. And this is not a take for granted first round game. So we're going to have to be on our game and play the best that, that we can possibly play. And and in 2A, the St. Luke's Wildcats making a complete turnaround this year. Last season, St. Luke's finished 2-8 and overall and not even close to playoff contention. This year, the Wildcats have only one loss on the season and finished first in the region, giving them home field advantage in round one as they host New Brockton Friday night. St. Luke's head coach Ron Lee says he couldn't be more proud of this team. They've never quit, and, and there have been some really tough Friday nights for us, but uh, they put a smile on their face and come back to work, and, and they worked hard, and this, this is kind of what high school ball is about, is to never give up, and if you keep working, you're going to finally get a reward, and this is our reward this year.